Mrs H and welcome to the Sunday shave to the weekend shave how's the week been wasn't long ago I was saying we're halfway through the week welcome to the Wednesday shave and I said it'll soon be weekend and here we are thank you very much very happy to be here um, right I'm using a razor from Ireland Irish razor not far from us and like the Scottish the Welsh and the Irish, we're all Celts, but that has nothing, <laughs> well, it does have something to do with this, I'm Welsh, the, this is Irish, and it is the Manly Stuff uh, Slant, Slant Bar Razor, and this is a two-piece, non-adjustable razor, another slant, um, good weight to it, nicely balanced, and good grip, you can see the rings, or the grooves there, um, and it states on the website all the slant razors have, have uh, brass handles and brass heads which is good and I'll just you twist the bottom here a bit squeaky and there's a good long thread on this there we go you can see the brass there showing through because it's coated in a matte black and I'm using a brand new Big Ben double-edged blade to see how we get on with that so that's the, the razor so we stick it in and the good thing with this you can hear it hear the kick where it's bending the blade once it starts to watch this now hear it just, just uh, there <laughs> and that's it tight and it's a good even um, blade exposure each side and there is overhang to be aware of as there usually is in razors nice razor I have used it um, I've used this and soap commander courage absolutely love this stuff good soap oh the smell <laughs> smell that it's beautiful and I've got that in the captain's choice original shave bowl and I'm going to use the brush of choice it has been soaking for 10 minutes and someone asked about soaking brushes um, if you can if you soak it in your bloom water or in the sink but I try and stand my brush up like that and soak it to about here because this is a wooden handle and it looks after the because if you're using hot water you don't use too hot but tap hot water is okay but don't forget that inside there there's glue and you've got wood so just below I soak it for about 10 minutes so I'll re-wet that and that's how it is when it comes out so I give it about one two three shakes it's wet but it's not dripping and then we'll go straight <sighs> we should have smell it beautiful right add water it'll take a good bit of water this this is a grey dog brush and this is the two band badger so hence the soaking the brush if you're using a synthetic you don't have to soak it you just have to to wet that brush if that's for anybody coming into the shaving of course I'm not trying to teach an old dog new tricks there we go soon becomes apparent and peaking there we go that's good enough I think look at that beautiful right wet the old face so how is life treating you? <laughs> I hope it's treating you well beautiful roses we've had them a few times lovely very honoured so off we go uh, sub commander courage look at that grey dog two band badger brush lovely colour that wood isn't it the colours you can see on here the scent on this is absolutely amazing And of course you can lather this soap up as much for as long as you want it'll become thick creamy 
but me personally I can't wait to shave so but you've got to have good coverage oh smell that please smelling up like someone oh, I've lost the hair there it's like someone said we don't want the uh, cutting app or something where you can uh, feel the cut and things like that. It's terrible, isn't it? Right. So I hope you're in good health and having good shaves on top of having a good week. Get on with it, Paul. Okay, okay. So Manly Stuff Slant Bar Razor. I'll put a link to the website so you can see the details of these razors and other things they sell um, the weights and all that sort of stuff um, and very reasonably priced for what they are very good brass off we go big oh that's nice feeling big blend big blend big Ben blade Is Big Ben in London, is it still covered with um, scaffolding? They're doing it up, aren't they? Which is nice to see, because it's a, an icon, it's a really British... That's the thing people, when they think of Britain, an iconic building is one of the things, as it was like Buckingham Palace, uh, Big Ben and the government, the, uh, or the Palace of Westminster, as it's officially known. Listen to me, eh? All knowledge today. All of it use useless. That's a lovely feeling, Razor, this. You can feel the blade exposure. But it gives a lovely, comfortable, smooth shave and just cuts through these whiskers because the chin, your chin has quite a heavy growth on it. Beard growth on there. Good test for a razor, your chin. That's lovely. That's a lovely first pass, so we'll just uh, clean up a bit. There we go. Tidy, tidy up, and uh, we'll go on to pass number two. Welcome to pass number two. So I'm going to gather more from the from the bowl. Loads in that brush. Just a bit of water. Does like water this, and it's really, really nice. Ooh, the scent. Oh, look at that brush. is beautiful. It's a nice scent courage. It's a nice uh, sort of cologne scent. The hairs away. Um, like a nice aftershave scent, you know, that type of nice, really nice. So across the growth. It's not a mild razor and it's not aggressive. It's a uh, you can feel that blade, so to some it would be aggressive, but uh, for me personally, it's a sort of medium aggression. Nice balance as you shave as well, there's no... Um, it's balanced nicely in the hand, or it feels nice, although the... Um, 
it is handle heavy, so it's more it is heavier this end. The balance is somewhere, is it around there? Somewhere there. It's nice. So if you're from Ireland, or you've got Irish blood in you, uh, and you love shaving, I can recommend one of these. Listen to that, good audio feedback. Still being Still being cautious of that overhang. People go on, why do you mention this overhang all the time? Because when you cut yourself with it, you won't forget either. Because <laughs> you concentrate so much on the blade, you forget. Listen to that, beautiful. You forget about the, uh, the overhang. It's a lovely second pass. We'll clean up. And uh, I'll see you in pass number three. Welcome back to pass number three. So I'm just going to go straight. I'm not going to go to water or the puck. There's more than enough in this brush. Made a bit too much actually, getting too excited. Beautiful slickness, easy to lather, Be gorgeous scent, and good protection during the shave. Um, that's all you can ask for really, it's very nice. So off we go against the growth now. Are you up to anything nice this weekend? But have you done anything nice? Are you doing anything nice today? Sunday dinner. Well, it's going to be a roast lamb. Steaks or chops? Oh no, it'll be steaks. That's right. Legs, steaks. Roasted and... Uh, I may add a little bit of rosemary on top as it cooks, just to infuse it a bit. And then, this is nice. Boiled baby potatoes, cauliflower, broccoli, um, Mint sauce on the lamb is a must, and maybe a bit on the old uh, potatoes. We'll see. Uh, salted potatoes because I salt the water as they boil, and um, lachentos of gravy. Lashentos. Double Lashentos this week because I didn't have any last week. Listen to that audio feedback. That is beautiful. Very nice this. And I must say, the uh, on the, this third pass, obviously with the whiskers gone mostly now, um, 
it feels slightly more aggressive now because you can actually feel that blade but in a nice way could be the blade as well uh, if you were to use a feather in this it would feel even more aggressive so it's uh, the blade has a lot to do the blade you're using has a lot to do with it but it, uh, it is uh, for me a mid, mid aggression razor I'm very comfortable and very nice Uh, if you somebody said to me, how would you compare this to the fine slant or the uh, the Merca 45 red and black or the PAA or the 39C? Um, this is more than the 39C slightly and um, it's a job. This is metal, them are plastic, but it's yeah, roughly the same, maybe. Um, I don't know, that PAA might be slightly more than this, uh, but um, they're not far off each other, but uh, they are in sort of very near order, but this is a mid-aggression, if anybody's interested. That's beautiful. Oh, the scent, and it's not just on here, you, you can smell this courage scent, the soap commander, in the room sort of thing that you know that somebody thinks you've just put aftershave on that scent when right. somebody puts aftershave on they walk away you come in you think oh that's nice that type of thing anyway stop gibbering and jabbering on to pickup time and uh, welcome to pickup time I'm gonna go back to the water just a bit and then Really nice. Pick up time. Come on, Paul. All right, then we'll go for it. Look at this now. Not beautiful, that. I'll tell you what. I'm not going to waste this, I'll go for a fifth pass on the, or fourth pass I should say. I can't even count, that'll do. That's beautiful, oh, ugly slick. Right, this is the razor. Let me get these out of the way first. Fourth pass. very gently And I've got um, I've got 
to say a scrumpy jack cider today. Four tins. Two of which will be consumed as I don my chef's outfit on. No, I'm only joking. My, uh, as I do my cooking. You know. That is beautiful. Right, rinse off. Nice and relaxing. So using some good products today. Not the uh, inexpensive. Use the good and the inexpensive, which they're all good, but it's, um, some are up here, some are down here in the costs. Um, and you can tell when you pay money for good stuff. Right, Thayer's Lavender today. Now treat the skin. Beauty, oh that smell, I have used that for a while, that's lovely. Witch hazel, good for the skin. And another thing to people that are new to shave, wet shaving, don't go buying everything. You know, I know it's exciting and stuff like that, but make sure, very important, so you haven't got allergies to things. So buy samples or free samples and just try them and you, you might think, oh, that doesn't feel right. You know, then you've got an allergy something, and then something you enjoy and you haven't got an allergy to, you can go and buy the proper puck then and spend what you want on it. But uh, just save you wasting money. And um, after shave, I'm going to use this. This is beautiful stuff. Faro, no, Alpa, it's like Faro. Yeah, Alpa Faro. And um, beautiful after shave. And you pull the top. And again, this was uh, sent to me a long time ago. Oh, come on, please, come on. Get the nostrils on, that's beautiful stuff, this. A bit more. And to be fair, no, no, no sort of feedback there. I thought, ooh, I thought it would be a bit, bit of a thing. Oh, come on, come on, smell it. Oh, beautiful stuff. Right. And then soap commander courage aftershave balm. Perfect. That's a nice scent. That. This aftershave, it's one of those you know when you put it on, it's nice. But when you've put it on after f f seconds, it's even nicer. One of those. And that's a good combination cream with that. For me. Oh, I really enjoyed this. Really enjoyed it. Wouldn't be the same without your company. Let me tell you. Right, that is it. So, a quick recap, and then I'll leave you in peace. So have your own shaves. And so, we've used the manly stuff uh, from Ireland, Irish razor, and it's the uh, matte black slant slant bar razor. Uh, as I say. It states on the website all the slants are made with brass handles and brass heads. Um, Non-adjustable two-piece razor. Use the Big Ben blade. Whole combination was fantastic, as you can see. Really worked well. Nice mid aggression for me there. Use this beautiful thing made for me by Grey Dog, a two-band badger brush, with that beautiful handle, and I love the colour of that wood. It's beautiful. The uh, Captain's Choice, right? Captain, thank you very much. Captain's Choice original bowl. Um, we've used 
Soap Commander Courage Shaving Soap and Aftershave Balm. The scent is superb, love it, absolutely love it. When I smelt uh, Alistair's, my friend, I just had to have some, and they sent me them because the, Soap Commander watched the video where I said, oh, I'd love, I'm going to order some or something. And they said, uh, we'll send you some, thank you very much, glad you liked it. So thank you again for this, really, really nice. And it lathers up, easy, nice protection during the shave, it's very slick. Just, it's good, it's good, uh, all rounder for me. And then we rinsed off with water, used the Thayer's Lavender Witch Hazel. This beautiful, which I can smell now, Alpa Faro. One of the nice, nicest ones in Alpa for me, apart from one or two others, which are different anyway, because they're sort of um, clovey or citrusy. But that is nice, that's like a, an expensive, cologne beautiful EDT type scent. Smells beautiful now, see how long that lasts. And that is it. So I'll leave you in peace and uh, hope you have, or having, a fantastic Sunday. And I hope you have a good start to next week, some great shaves. Stay in good health and stay positive and happy. And uh, I'll see you good people on Wednesday for the midweek shave. So thanks for watching and um, don't forget the giveaway will be coming in case people think I've forgotten. I haven't forgot, it's coming soon. Um, yeah, Merca Vision Wednesday. So uh, stay tuned for that. So I'll see you in the midweek shave. Take care.